Hey, what's going on guys? It's King Touch Pro and welcome back to another Final Cut Pro 10 tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to do the Jesse Wellens slash green screen effect. Now, this is probably one of the easiest tutorials you will ever see in your life. Now, that is because everything is built in into Final Cut Pro 10 already to do this effect. So, I'm pretty sure he uses Final Cut Pro 10, if anything, because of all of his very kind of simple but really unique um, vlogging editing techniques so if we go on to his video I'm gonna show you guys what I mean so you know the beginning of this video you guys saw the effect but right here this is the effect that I actually got it from on one of his videos here and he pulls out a really big green screen backdrop and he pretty much just adds a key on top and then places a video below that which I'll show you guys how to do in Final Cut Pro 10 but he just does this but this is like a bigger version of it I just did a mini version of it just so you guys can get the idea of it it looks really nice because of the smooth transition between the actual video and then the green screen so if anything this would be a green screen transition so if you go into Final Cut Pro 10 and we import some video now I already have this one enabled but I'm going to show you guys how to do this from scratch because a lot of you guys give me crap for this. So I'm going to go ahead and delete everything. So we have the video here and I just use this plain green cardstock paper here. And you want to make sure that you fill in the whole entire video just like this and that it's equally balanced. Now I did kind of mess up on this because the lighting was not the best. But you want to make sure that you have lighting focused everywhere so that the green screen here is all light, uh, lit up correctly so you can see that there's some dark shadows here which will affect the video a little bit but it's not going to make that big of a difference here and you want to make sure that you cover the whole entire camera with the green screen for this to work if you have you know your fingers in the way this is not going to work so we have the video here and I just do this I look at it and it's all good right so the next thing you want to go ahead and do is just add a video below that so what you want to go ahead and do is just add the video here behind it or below the video there and just find like a good placement to put this video but anyways I'm gonna go ahead and just kind of put this towards here and we have this going on. Select the video with the green screen, go to the effects. Now you guys probably already know how to do this, but if you guys don't, this is a really easy green screen effect that you guys can do. Just type in Kier. Make sure it's not the Luma Kier, because that's different. Make sure that it's the Kier there, and it's gonna look black, because there's nothing below the video there. It's just showing you what it look like. So go ahead and click and drag that on top, and then you're pretty much finished here. You guys can tweak it a little bit if you want. And honestly, that's the only thing that you need to do from this point. This is without any plugins. Everything here is in Final Cut Pro 10 that you guys can use. The only thing you need for this effect is, of course, a green screen. And that's honestly all you have to do. So let's go ahead and play it one more time. So I'm going to go ahead and make this full screen. So I pick up the paper here. It's green screen, like I said, just a normal cardstock. And then I put it towards the lens. And then it just suddenly changes onto the next video there. So if you found this video helpful in any way, be sure to leave a like. That'd be awesome, guys. Comment down your guys' requests. I have listed a whole bunch of video ideas, so just keep that in mind. Uh, and they're not all going to be you know, put out every day, but I'm going to try my best to find out or to find the best tutorials to put on this channel. So turn on post notifications, please. That'd be awesome. The little bell right here on my channel, of course. Be sure to check out Jesse. Subscribe. He has some awesome videos. I'm pretty sure you guys already know who he is. But until then, I'm going to catch you guys next time. Peace out. Take care and enjoy your day.